My name is Thomas Gelder. Welcome back to another video. So we're starting it different today. We're gonna start it on the GoPro. So today I'm gonna teach you how to become Flash. Yes, I'm gonna teach you how to become a superhero all in under two minutes. Let's see what you need in production before you start post-production. You need a clean plate, you need the action shot, and you need the ending shot. So now that I've got the shot, I'm gonna bring it back into the editing suite and then show you guys how it's done. Now once you're in the editing suite, make sure you bring the clips into the timeline. You want the clean plate at the bottom and you want the starting clip on the second layer and you want the ending clip also on the second layer. Make sure you're cutting the parts that you need. Once you've got your starting and your ending, go to the starting of the action shot, go to end of the clip on the last frame, screenshot it, save it, bring the screenshot into the editing suite and bring it onto the third layer of the editing timeline. Here, you're gonna drag it right to the end of the start clip. Make sure there's a little gap between the start and the ending. This is where the flash effect is gonna be happening. So make sure it's around four frames forward or five frames forward. You don't want it too long. And here, you're just gonna key out yourself. Once you keyed out yourself, what you're gonna do is you're gonna toggle the position and toggle the scale. And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to end of the clip and then reposition and scale it till it fits appropriate and matches the ending clip. A way to do this is to drag the end clip underneath the screenshot, bring the screenshot opacity down and just position it where the ending clip is gonna be. That's basically the effect done. To sell it even more, what you wanna do is go into the effects tab, go on blur, drag in directional blur, bring the direction to 90% and then bring the blur length to about 11 to 15. And then what else you want to do is bring up the feathering because that softens the effect a little bit more. And that's it. If you like this video, please make sure you like, comment and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.